My name is Gunara Yusupov. I graduated from Moscow University and um, I would say that almost 35 years I am in the field of translation of the ribosome studying the mechanism of biosynthesis of protein. Ribosome is a giant macromolecule. From a pharmaceutical point of view, a very important uh, object because it's the main target of antibiotics. But after a certain time, I understood that to understand how the ribosome is functioning, you have to understand the structure. And uh, this was the most difficult task for us. And uh, we spent uh, uh, maybe 15 years to get uh, final uh, structure of ribosome. Uh, and this way was from beginning for, to obtain crystals, after to obtain uh, diffraction from these crystals, and after to decipher this diffraction pattern to obtain three-dimensional structure of ribosome. Even my son asking me uh, that how we are so devoted to one project. But I think because we were two of us, me and my husband, uh, it was easy to survive. If I would be alone, probably I will not be so uh, determined. We met each other in Russia, working in the same laboratory, but I never wanted to work with him, and of course I never was thinking to work with him. But because of our life, all the spirit of our movement, we start to work uh, in foreign countries, and uh, we increased not two times, but maybe hundred times our efficiency working together. It's not only two persons who worked. We had always fantastic collaborators in Russia, in France, and the United States. And now we have a very good team. Uh, it's young people who are very enthusiastic, uh, ready to work hard in Strasbourg. It's almost magic. We can see in detail, in atomic level, what's going on in ribosome when ribosome is synthesizing proteins. We can explain the reason why so many disease connected to ribosome appeared and we can probably treat this disease. You cannot work uh, without uh, positive results, otherwise uh, you will be really depressed. I'm uh, not so strong iron woman. And music was for me my own world and uh, it relaxed me very much. I have feeling that I have another life, not only life of scientists.